Hey guys, what is up? Aoki here bringing you some more Pokemon Unite content and I am very excited about today's video because we got a brand new champion, Blissey. I've been waiting for her uh, because I'll be honest guys, I'm coming from League of Legends which is probably where a lot of people that are watching this know me from. Uh, and I'm I'm a support. I'm the greatest support alive in League of Legends, but I have to be honest with you I have not played support in Pokemon Unite uh, The one basically like main support champion that they've actually had in the game up until now Eldegoss just did not interest me uh, So I'm more than willing to give Blissey a chance. I'm glad to see that they are you know kind of fleshing out the uh, You know the roster with this game and not making it everyone just like one shots and all, all this stuff so because like in a proper MOBA you you need you need the supports you need tanks you need you know actual other classes whereas right now I think the meta is just kind of like taken over by just pure damage dealing champions so here we are we're not yet blissy yet uh, we start the game as um, Ch 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 Chansey right it's a Chansey um, sorry not a, not a, been a while boys been a while since we've uh, been in the Pokemon world but we're starting the game off of as Chansey and then we get at level 4 we evolve into blissy who is a tank healer, a dedicated tank healer, looks really, really fun, uh, and she is fun. Wow, that is a ridiculous looking Snorlax. I have no idea what this guy was doing, but uh, you ain't scoring on Chansey's watch, buddy. You ain't scoring when Chansey's around. Alright, so as you can see, we start the game with Pound, which is very similar to uh, Jigglypuff's Whack Whack Whack, except it's just one big Pound. Uh, and then we've got Heal Pulse. At level 4, we are going to be leveling it up to Soft Boiled. So, uh, Blissey is a dedicated healer tank. And when I say dedicated healer tank, like, she does a lot of healing and she does a lot of tanking. Um, Snorlax, up until this point, is, like, pretty much the uncontested god of tanks in this game. But I, I seriously think Blissey is going to give, her a run, uh, give him a run for his money. Okay, he already got his Blissey. So, as you can see, the uh, empowered auto attacks actually work a little bit different than most champions. Most champions you uh, attack three times and then you get one empowered auto attack. Blissey just kind of gets like one every now and then. Don't die buddy. Don't die buddy. I'm trying to save you big guy. Oh my god. Wait, we actually saved him? Okay, now we get soft boiled, which uh, gives us, I think, it, I think it stacks up to three times and you can just like targeted heal with uh, one of your allies. So boom, heal. You see that? We can do it again. We can do it to him again in a very, very short cooldown once you stack one up. Get off of our neutral camp, boy. So we'll just do it just to demonstrate there. See, there's another soft boiled. So I like that because you can stack it up to three times, come into like an ongoing team fight, and just bop, 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 like rapid fire heal someone. See, I'm just letting him do most of the damage here. Although honestly, Blissey does do like quite a bit of her, quite a bit of damage on her own, especially with that auto uh, empowered auto. Go get him, buddy! Go get him, buddy! Look at that, dude! We are two v threeing down here, guys. We are two v threeing. So obviously, you want to be positioning, uh, well, one at the forefront of fights, but also not like so much that you are the only one that has access to their back backline. If that makes sense. Like you're tanking, you want you want to be in there, but you're also a healer. So I, I think that's like a really cool uh, kind of like duality that they've created because most healers, like especially coming from League of Legends, like healers are usually super super squishy, right? So they're wanting to like position in the back line and not get hit by anything. But uh, Blissey can really just get in there. We got Helping Hand, which is uh, it now buffs movement speed, basic attack speed, and boosts any basic attack for a short period of time, including her own. So we're just getting in there. We're causing chaos. We're making all of our teams stronger. Uh, it's this is a really really fun champion. If I had to, if I had to, um, kind of compare it to a League of Legends champion, I would say that she's somewhere between like Yumi, Lulu, Soraka. And then also, uh, dude, I don't, I don't even know. Like, I don't. There really, there really aren't like tanky healers in League of Legends. So this is like something completely new. But I like this. We got softball. We got soft boiled, which is where you get the targeted stun to one of our allies. And then we got helping hand, which, if you notice, when I use it, it doesn't slow you down at all. Like you don't have to stop. There's no cast time for this. So I, re I really, really like that actually. You're right in the action. Also, they hardcore nerfed uh, eject button, aka flash. So you need, you want to be paying a lot more attention to uh, when you're using it. 
Boom. All right, and then wait until we get our Unite move, guys. The Unite move on Blissey is absolutely cracked, bro. So, so cracked. Boom, movement speed, basic attack as well. I think I am going to use my flash there. Grab one of the berries. Hit my boy up with the heal. Hit my boy up with the helping hand. They're trying to dive us, but they don't understand. They don't understand how freaking tanky we are, boys. Uh, as for our held items, we've got Focus Band, Muscle Band, and then Buddle Buddy Barrier. Uh, I wouldn't worry too much about the items. I think literally one of my items is actually only like level 6 or something. Um... Again, like I say in all my Pokemon Unite videos, I wouldn't be worrying too much about the items. Uh, if you're trying to be get better at this game and learn more about the game, I promise you there's way more that you can be doing to improve your play, rather than just like focusing on, oh man, do I have to pay for the items? Like the items give like a, a decent stat boost and like, you know, stuff like that, but it, there, there's a lot more going on. All right, I'm gonna use my uh, Unite move here. So if you saw, I just got a double knock up which brings a lot of great CC to this character. So you essentially choose one of your allies and you go to assist them. And then let me read everything that the Unite move actually does. Uh, it benefits... Oh, shoot. Sorry, bud. I was reading. Alright, Bliss Assistance is uh, uh, Blissey's Unite move. You get it at level 8. In keeping with Blissey's status as a supported Pokemon, the main person who benefits from the move will be one of your allies. For this reason, you must be very careful when performing this move because you can easily miss your target. Ideally, you should use it when fighting Zapdos or when the opposing team is crowding one of your goals. Um, it essentially, just gives like a massive, massive boost to one of your allies. Gives them Buddy Barrier. Gives them a bunch of shielding, healing, all kinds of like huge stat boost. It's just massive. But the thing that I think is really, really fun about it is that when you fly to use it on one of your allies, it knocks up every one of the enemy teams. Oh, man. I'm going to try to flash out of that. Oh, baby. I'm too fast with Helping Hand, boys. I'm too fast. All right, we're pulling a lot of pressure down here. I am super, super tanky, so I don't think they'll be able to dive me here, actually. Dude, this is, like, honestly a really, really fun Pokemon, though. You're so fast. You're so tanky. You're just pumping out ridiculous stat boost. There you go, baby. There you go, baby. Oh, now we've got our upgraded helping hand, too. Okay, okay. It's literally Snorlax's ultimate. Oh, he's almost got me, boys. Nope, helping hand. Dude, this... Okay, this is not balanced. Blissey is not balanced at all, guys. I'm going to try to have my uh, ultimate up for Zapdos. We can get, like, a big five-man ulti. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Dude, there is nothing tankier in this game than Blissey. I'm, I'm serious. Like, good Snorlax players have kind of, like, dominated the game up until now. But good Blissey, like, good Blissey players are going to be absolutely terrifying. Let's see if I can steal this. Oh, I almost stole it, bro. Okay, I don't want to be 1v1ing this guy, though. Just baiting him. Just baiting him for my teammate there. Hit you with the heal. Hit you with the heal. Alright, we're in the lead. Zapdos just spawned. Wait, this guy is uh, in thing. This guy is hardcore in thing. Okay, I'm going to drop the ulti. Dropping the ulti. We're huge. We're huge. Don't let this guy score. Let's go do Zapdos after, guys. Let's go do Zapdos after. I'm heading to the central area, boys. We just got three picks. Oh, it's important to know you can also use soft boiled on yourself. So it's, you can use it just like as a straight up sustain move. Uh, we kind of took like way too long to do Zapdos here. I don't actually know if we win this. I'm going to go heal my boy Snorlax. Hey, Blissey's here. You guys are in trouble. You guys are in freaking trouble, aren't you? Oh, yeah. We getting in there, baby. We getting in there, and nothing's going to stop us. All right, we got three dead. There's always still a chance that they steal Zapdos. I think I'm actually just going to go score in their bot lane. Oh, we just got wiped, guys. I actually can't keep them alive. No. Uh, we might be in trouble, boys. We just threw. We just 
We just had a big old throw this century. Yeah, they actually get zapped us. Oh man, we lose this game, bro. We lose this game. <clears throat> we'll see if we can stop any of them. Yeah, this is a loss. This is an L, boys. It's an L, but you know what? I still had a ton of fun showing off Blissey. I still had a ton of fun. This this character really is, like, super, super wild. How many... Did, did we ever die this game? I think we only got, like, one death, even if that... Let me know down in the comments. Did I ever die, guys? So, it is a, it is an unfortunate loss, but uh, I still had fun, and the purpose of the video was not to necessarily win, but to show off Blissey and uh, give you guys my thoughts on her. And uh, I'm really, really excited. I definitely think that this game needed more dedicated supports rather than just like hyper one-shotting everything uh, because proper MOBAs need that ebb and flow, right? They need the balance. They need the yin and yang. They need the people that can one-shot and then they need the people that can keep you from getting one-shotted. So uh, that's Blissey, guys. Brand new champion. Let me know down in the comments if you guys want to see some more Blissey gameplay. I actually really, really like her. Take it easy, boys. Peace.